Alright. Hey guys, Papa Emu here. We are back in Skyrim, the loveliness of Skyrim that is Skyrim. The Elder Scrolls Skyrim. Yeah, that was cool of me. Fucking rhyme Skyrim with Skyrim. Uh <laughs> so I just got out of that cave and we are still on our way to Falkreath because we got an offer from the Jarl to become a Thane, and I would love to be uh, a new Thane. I'm actually, I was playing, I play a game, uh, a free game online. Online. It's on my phone. It's a mobile game. I'm also going to steal bugs because I'm hungry. Uh, it's called uh, Valkyrie Connect, and I am actually in a guild where the, that's just made me think of it. I'm in a guild where the uh, main guy is called the Jarl, and then he's got the co-Jarls. Are you nice? I hope you're nice. You speak to a vigilant of Stendar. Cavort with any Daedra, and we will hunt you down. None escape the vigil. Do you convert with any Daedra? Because I don't want to be hunted down right now. Just tell me right now. No? No? Okay. Hey! Walk always in the light. Who or are Stendar? He is the god of mercy. Oh, who are Stendar? Who's Stendar? For all of ah, I'm already we bored. It sounds too preachy. Where none can be found. By cleansing all those who would offend his children. No one's listening. Not even you, Sophia. I feel like I say Sophia weird. I probably do. And there's probably someone who's going to get really pissed off when they see it. And then, like, go on every single video I ever release and just, uh, like, give it a thumbs down. I'm going to be really sad. I probably won't stop, but I'm going to be sad about it. I always wondered why, like, I used to think, like, why why would somebody keep making YouTube videos if they just make really shitty content? And then I started making YouTube videos and really shitty content. So now I know why. At least I'm not stealing other people's content. Unless you think playing other people's mods is considered stealing, then. Fuck. I don't know why I'm bringing this up. I feel like I could just put break, like put myself in a lot of trouble real quick for no good reason. Okay, let's get out our bow. So we're gonna do some sneaky peeky. -ing. Oh, it is a vampire. Yeah, why are you even talking? Looks like we got ourselves a Kill her! Idiot! Where'd she go? Seriously, where the fuck did she go? I do not fear death. How drink Ow. <laughs> fuck you. We're a vampire. Ooh! Ooh! We can be matching! I'm gonna have us matching. We're gonna match because we're yes, a couple I'm of cuties. Oh, you're no fun. Oh, I have you. Oh, you're storing a lot of crap. Okay. We're gonna match though because you're really we're gonna be cute. Huh. Oh, you're no fun. No! How about for a change you do something to. I mean, for me? Uh, what? Okay. I'm gonna take off that. 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 Okay, so we're gonna re equip you. We're gonna make you look really cool. First, we're gonna put some vampire armor. Oh, you get the. Oh, no, I like actually the red more, but still, you're gonna look cool. No, oh, shit. Give. What? Why do they need boob windows? Whatever. Um, you need some gauntlets. And you need a helmet. No, that looks really silly. Give me that helmet back. Give that back. <laughs> and now on Dress Up with Papa Emu. <laughs> no, no. Oh, that actually looks cool. You look nice. Um, you definitely aren't using the. Sh haven't been using the shield. I noticed that. Uh, I think you need. No, we gave you some boots. All right, we'll give you. 
Dagger, no. Look at the orc sword. Yeah. Oh, you look you fucking cool. Evening. I don't. I'm not a fan of the boob window, but you still look pretty cool. Here we go, let's start on it. Where is it? Lock picking, lock picking, lock picking, lock picking, lock picking. There we go. Each grants 15,000 gold and a free perk point. I am down for that. I should also use that other skill point, but whatever. And also get back that arrow that I wasted. Do I have any better arrows? I hope I have some better arrows. 10. Yeah, that's pretty much. Our limit on arrows. Right up the ass. Remember to always get your prostate exam by a hired professional. Otherwise, you can just stand up with an arrow up your ass. Right in the crotch or tibia. I'm glad they don't have her having like a really short skirt. That would be really uncomfortable. But that circlet on your head does look really well with that armor. Welcome to Papa Emu's fashion corner. I'll be boring you today. Whoa. Oh, shit. Hmm? Oh, shit. What's happening? You're doing great. Fuck. Oh, is that like a trap? Huh. Weird. Didn't seem like much of a trap. What, is there another one? <laughs> oh, ow, fuck. You have projectiles, idiot. Use them. See? Oh, you fucking idiot. I can't see him, whatever. If you want to keep fighting them like an idiot, you can. You can use some fire to light them up. I don't know why you'd use fire on skeletons. I feel like they'd be have a little bit of resistance to them. But hey, what am I? What am? Who am I gonna argue with? Who am I gonna argue with? Hide boots. That's a lot of boots. What's with all the boots? Oh. Oh, is some people being taken here to be killed? That's not very nice. Be nice. Oh. I've always wondered, since when people die, they take their final form as they were when they died. If you die naked, you fear to me naked. I can't say a fancy roaming around either in some way, the ghost will... Any... clothes on. Well, at least not all the time. Yeah. What? Okay. Yeah, it's worth a lot. Iron gauntlets? Fuck that. What? Uh, does none of these open act anything that's actually useful? Come on. Leather armor. I think that was actually better than what I'm wearing, which is unfortunate. Because I really like this vampire stuff. We'll save it. It's not like it's a big jump. Hmm? Oh. They say okay. actions speak loud in their words, so I'll have <coughs> weapons to the talking. What up? I think I'm gonna get hit by a trap. I think I got gonna get hit by a, like a trap. Or a booby trap. Buck. I gotta think of. <laughs> Remember to put just a picture of uh, what's her face's cleavage when I say booby trap. Oh. Huh? Oh. Oh, that was. Oh. Okay. 
All right, so I just locked myself in. That's fine. Hopefully there's a way out. I don't feel like trying to figure it all that shit out. Yo, dude. Oh, 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 oh. Let's go. It's sneaky. Sneak up on him. Yeah. How do you cancel the air? Okay, there we go. All right. My head. Oh. Luckily, I got that hard bone helmet. Or else that would have taken my head clean off. No. The noise of the skeletons is very distinct, but also irritating. So it's just a bunch of bones kind of creaking around. Sounds like my friend's bones. He's got a... He has some very... <gasps> Fuck. Leave here alive. Nope. Ah! Oh. My friend, uh, when he and I would work out, he has some very, uh... Some very crunchy knees. Whenever he does squats, it sounds like Velcro. It's very unsettling. And he has to listen to music whenever he does squats or else he gets psyched out by how crunchy his knees are. Okay. Sneak around the corner. Not seeing anyone. I don't know if anyone's kind of guessed it by now, but I am a little... I'm kind of a jumpy person. I don't... I can't understand why. It's not like anything's genuinely very scary. Nothing in life is genuinely scary. Is basically what I just said. Alright, yeah, now's not the time for talking. See you wanna sneak. Can I tell you how much I love sneaking? She is pretty funny. I do like her dialogue a lot, and the voice acting is top notch. anyone really wants a very unique companion I would definitely recommend Sophia because she has she's pretty great I do really I do like that she comments a lot on uh -huh. what's going on around her. You, I spell <gasps> oh shit this guy's tough Potion of pain. I'm gonna grab some more of that armor just because it looks really cool and I want to use it later. Speech. We'll take that. Are you not, like, cold? I feel like you'd be cold. I feel like all of Skyrim is just perpetually, like, at a very uncomfortable, like, cold temperature. That's why the Nords have the frost resistance. Boom! Actually built it into the. I actually know a little bit. Battle tide. Steal 80 points of armor rating from nearby target for 30 seconds. The caster gains the total amount stolen. Oh, my freaking knee hurts. Hearing the finer illusion. Battle axe. Oh, I thought he said of destiny. Battle axe and destiny. Ah, oh, my freaking knee. I sit with my. I sit cross legged. And I think I've sit, sat cross-legged like so much just over the years that it's just worn down like the tendon. Or just like kind of strained my left knee. So whenever I go back to sitting in a normal position it just kind of hurts. Oh. Oh, I think we're going to have to fight something here. Hey! What? Oh. I thought it was just a regular dude. <laughs> Epic. Epic combat. I shouldn't complain, I'm the one who has the OP sword. Ooh, I never tried out Ars, uh, Arcanum or whatever. Elemental Fury. Which is the spell, or the mod that allows you to melt Most down weapons and armor for. I'm not buying you shit. Uh, it's the one that allows you to melt down armors and weapons for, uh, like weapon and crafting material which is oh, good what why ooh let me try this let me try 
Um. Shouts. 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 Elemental Fury. The Thum imbues your arms with the speed of wind, allowing you a weapon to attack faster. That sounds really nice. Control required to unlock this slot. Okay. So I think I have one. Yeah, I do. Okay. Come ethereal. Yeah. Changing your form to one that cannot harm or be harmed. Fine! Yeah, boy! Ah! <laughs> ah! Oh, no! <laughs> Fuck! Alright, well, that's where I'm gonna cut it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, remember to leave a comment of anything you want to see, and maybe any comments of how I can do better. Some constructive criticism is always welcome. Thank you so much for watching.